If you love watching glamorous videos and would like to be notified every time we drop a new one, please bash that bell icon below. She's asking how does she bring glowing skin during her monsoon because the skin looks very dull. Yes, Mahima, I know. Now the monsoon is almost going. So maybe this is a redundant question, but nonetheless, I'll answer it. Uh, because of the humidity, the monsoon, are get, they give us a lot of humidity. Because of the humidity, there is the skin is looking dull. So one thing you have to do is exfoliate your skin. See, when the dead cells stick to your skin, that means it doesn't look shiny or glowing. So all you have to do is that Chain your face wash, number one. The face wash has to be one which contains, uh, which, which is sort of exfoliating. So you can use an exfoliating face wash and uh, that you can use say three times a week. Use that, so then all the dead, superficial dead cells are removed and also you can use a, an oil-free moisturizer. You know, a gel, because sometimes if the skin is dry also, it looks dull. So use an oil-free, a gel-based moisturizer and of course a sunscreen. So do this and at night, I would advise vitamin C creams or serums, which are about 15% vitamin C, that will help. Should I... Tell her about a DIY. I was just going to ask you, okay. do you have a DIY? Yeah, I have a DIY for this and uh, you know how everyone loves the DIY. <laughs> go, go, to, go back to your kitchen and take uh, moong dal, you know moong dal with chilka. So coarse grind it and uh, dry coarse grind it, keep it in your bathroom. Splash water on your face, take a little bit on your palm and uh, make a paste and apply it on your face. Just rub it gently. That's your natural, chemical-free <laughs> exfoliant and that gives great results. You can use it daily. So this one's for dry skin. For this, you'll need uh, five to six blanche almonds, half a cup of cream, two teaspoons of sesame oil and one teaspoon tulsi powder. For oily skin, you'll need 3 teaspoons of chickpea flour, 2 teaspoons of sandalwood powder, 1 teaspoon fenugreek seeds and 1 4 teaspoon turmeric powder. You can mix it with rose water. For pigmented skin, you'll need 2 tablespoons of besan, 1 tablespoon of cucumber juice, half a teaspoon of turmeric powder, 1 4 cup red lentil paste, 1 tablespoon of sandalwood powder and some oats. Mix all these ingredients to form a smooth paste. It should not be watery or too thick. And then after that, just apply it on your face in circular motions. Leave it on for five to 10 minutes and just wash it off with lukewarm water. You will see your face shine bright like a star. Thank you so much. Have a great day. Until next time, stay tuned and stay glamorous.